<laughs> it's so weird just staring at me. I'm like, hi. Hi, guys. Welcome to my channel. It's my special guest, Taya. <laughs> Back to my YouTube channel today. I have a special guest, Tyler. I think the last video I was like, I put in the caption, I was like, "Hi, Tyler," because you're like, "Hey guys," and I was like, "Introduce yourself," and you're like, "I'm Tyler." And I put a caption, I was like, "Hi, Tyler." Doing a video. Um, I got this video idea from Desi Perkins and Katie. She they did like a their first um doing random stuff. So I have them all written down. What we're gonna say. So I probably should hide this because I don't want you knowing every single one of them. So yeah, basically I'm going to be saying like first time doing something and then we have to obviously like answer it just to get like a more, a good Is idea. Is it a game? No, like no one wins or loses, but it's just like entertainment, I guess. Ready? Yeah. First job aspiration. <laughs> so like what did you like first want to do when you were a kid? Like when you wanted to grow up, what did you want to do? <laughs> Be a bus driver. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. Mine was probably probably a teacher. Yeah, no, I didn't strive that high. Um, but now obviously it, uh, that changed like five hundred times. Your first concert was it Jason Aldean? We went to. I don't think I'm I went. To... Oh wait, Betty Wop. Duh. No, not my first. It was either Jason Michael Carroll or it was Sugarland. Ready? Damn. Oh God. <laughs> Hi, my name's Taya. So that was James. Across the street, James? Next door, James. Next door, James. I think my first like, cause the Jason Michael Carroll was at like a state fair. So I don't know if that really counts. But my first big concert was Sugarland. You went to Sugarland? I didn't know that. Yeah, it was really cool. They had like this white- Who'd you go with? Mom, dad, and Dan. They had like this white sheet, and she was like singing behind it, dropped, and it was like, Kakao! like that. I'm just really zooming cool. on that. <laughs> <laughs> My first concert, I think it was Fetty Wap. Baby, just won't a couple you years come ago. My way. What year was that? 2016? Um, something like that. Yep. All right. Be you. First car. Yeah, the Buick. Yeah, 2000 Buick Century. <laughs> like the white. Looked like my granddad drove it. <laughs> and it had like the blue interior on it. It's a shag mobile. Oh my view. gosh, it was actually, I mean, your dad still drives it, so. It's still kicking. My first car was, Chevy? well, no. Oh, no, the Taurus. I had a Ford, Ford Taurus, Taurus yeah. and then I got a Chevy Go Bolt. So I had like the Taurus for like a couple months. months. Yeah. yeah, it wasn't that long. Old Gus, though. And then we had the Cobalt. Um, I bought the Cobalt. We named it Gus because the license plate was like G-U-S. So we just named it Gus. And then that was passed down Mercedes. This car had like the check engine light ever since I bought it. Turned it off a lot. It was like a 2000, what was it? 2005, I think. Something around there. So yeah. it was such a <clears> shitty <throat> car, but it was like, I don't know. It was a really good car, though. Like we were so sad to like give it away because Mercedes ended up getting her new car. So it was like a really sad. It was pushing over like 200,000. Yeah, was that like 230,000? Something like that, yeah. 220,000? Did its time. Yeah. Um, it definitely lasted a lot more than we expected it to last. Um, your first big fear. Now, snakes. Without so, a doubt. Hate snakes. Probably snakes or spiders. They're so gross. <laughs> I hate snakes. Snakes, snakes, snakes. Your first big fight. 
your brother. Oh, oh. <laughs> Throttled him. I had a couple he, bites. He would call me out. So I smacked him. You he, smacked him or you punched him? No, I mean, I, like, I smacked him. Like, I got him. Oh. But he didn't fall. He just chased me down the stairs and then I sprained my ankle. <laughs> you win some, That's you lose some. That's your guys' relationship. You win some, you lose some, you know? My... I mean, my sister and I fought, Mercedes and I fought growing up all the time, but it wasn't like, it's just siblings fight like that. <laughs> no, have you ever fought with like a person, like at school or like Are we talking like, match? I'm going to punch you in the face? Or yeah, are we talking or like, like push or shove or? No. I'm too gentle. I'm gentle. Gentle soul. Um, I don't think I ever, someone in middle school kicked a pen at me, <laughs> but like that wasn't. I wanted to fight. You want to get messed up? <laughs> That's your thing. But that was... <laughs> Stop! That's my, that's my new thing. Stop. You're just jealous because um, everyone's going to come watch this video because I'm like... Mercedes, when we were fighting... This is back when we lived in the trailer park. Mercedes and I were fighting in the bathroom. She had a steak knife in her hand and oh Lily choked me and was like, I'm going to kill you! God. I was like... Bitch, you're psychotic. Like, stop. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> um, and then that same house, she like shoved me into a door, and we ended up break, or I ended up breaking it because she like pushed me into the mom and dad's door, and it like just it came down. And we're like, oh. sounds like you got your ass beat. Yeah, we were very physical. But when roles were reversed, and I was on to her and pushing her, she'd start crying and be like, Oh my god, stop! And I'm like, Yeah, it's the youngest You can't sibling. take it. You just can't. That's take the it. way out. Um, but no, I haven't really fought with any girl. I'm trying, I don't think I've ever had like a cat fight or like clawed people or like pulled someone's hair. I don't, no, I don't think so. First cell phone, iPhone 4. Oh, we don't count the iPod touch, right? <laughs> no, we that, don't count they the had the text app in <laughs> the text now, yeah. That's what you had. I remember when we first started dating, he had an iPod, like an iPod touch or whatever. And I was like, when are you going to get a phone? Like you're in like eighth grade. Like you're like Mom and dad didn't think old. I needed one. So then he finally got it. It was like the, the best thing ever. And then my first phone, I think it was a Blackberry. Oof, that's rough. No, I loved it. It was like the one with the little ball and you had to scroll with the ball. It was really cool. And then I had the Black keyboard. Bear. Okay, first childhood memory. Like the first ever memory you had. What was it? My Tonka truck getting thrown away. <laughs> Pissed me right off. <laughs> How old were you? Seven? I don't even know. Dan was like, got a little scratch on right just on the side. Dan's like, do it. Put it out the side. Guard bring it, he gonna come right out, he gonna take it. Bring you a new one back. Okay. I'm like, doo 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 doo, right out there. Set it down there, Go never came it. back. My first memory, I had to have been at least four or five. And we lived in Massachusetts. And I remember, this is probably like my first memory. And I, what? See you now. Yeah, we'll get there, we'll get there, we'll get there. Um, I had to have been like four or five because I was still in Massachusetts. And my neighbors, I think they were across the street, I don't remember. It. My neighbors across the street had this big pool. And I remember there was this big, I mean, thinking now it probably isn't that big because I was so small. And when you're younger, you think that things are a lot bigger when you're that young. And then you grow up and you're like, it's not really that small. Anyways, they had this big blow up for their pool. It was like a big caterpillar that you mm. could like lay on and crawl on and stuff. And that was like, it scared me. Like the pool floaty, like scared me. And I was like. Oh, that's, God, now you say that. I think that might've been earlier. The when I truck? No, when I almost oh. drowned and Terry saved me. And Terry did. That's scary. I was like on this floaty, like one of the circular ones. I was trying to be the cool. Donut. Yeah, I was trying to be cool, hanging out with all the older kids, and I was like, look at me, and I'd go under, <laughs> but I'd keep my hands, like, just on the floaty yeah. while I went through it, and they slipped, and I was, like, drowning. I couldn't swim at the time. So my Aunt Terry jumped in and, like, saved me from drowning. First time speeding, and getting, well, let's say first time getting a speeding ticket, because, let's be honest, we all speed, like, we speed all the time, but what was the first time getting a speeding ticket? Winnie Point. 
Tyler was going 85 and 55. In the 55. I was right past the state trooper. Late right? to work. Right past the state trooper. Meow. I was um, going downhill. Downhill. And he was like, why are you going so fast? <laughs> I was like, I'm running late for work. In reality, we had a safety how much was your How much was your speeding ticket? $200. And then first time I got a speeding ticket was... February, March, end of February. It was like the last day of February. It was February oh, twenty eighth. Is... Okay. Um, first pet that you can remember. Black lab, Seamus. I had, I guess in Washington when I was born, we had like two labs, a Dalmatian or something, and then we also Ooh, had like Dalmatian. a pit bull mix, and the pit bull mix like wasn't friendly towards like babies, so like they had to get rid of her. Um, but my number one pet that I remember actually getting and everything was Buzz and he was a black lab. I remember actually picking him up in Massachusetts and I probably, oh yeah, so that's probably another one of my first memories. Um, we, after we got him, we went to a McDonald's. We had like, I think we, we had the Suburban and we had like, we like, pulled, like backed up the truck and like had him like running around the grass. Like, oh, I miss him. He's but good yeah, I love Buzz, oh my goodness. Um, and then of course I had like, oh my god, I had a gerbil named Tinky, and then I had a couple, what are those fish? Beta? Beta fish, yep, I had a couple of those. I remember one of them I named Moby, because my dad was like, I should name Moby Dick. We got the Moby Dick, Moby. I was like, Moby, sure. And then I had a hamster named Pedro that I forgot to feed and died. Poor Pedro. I know. Okay, so first celebrity crush. I know this one. Oh, so do I. First one. First one? Megan Fox. Yeah, hell yeah. Yep. My first one was probably Justin Bieber. Like, as a little girl growing up, I didn't really have, like, a celebrity crush. I think yeah, I just... Yeah, Bieber fever. Yeah, I think, like, once Justin Bieber came out, I'm like, ooh, he's kind of cute. And then I was like, okay, whatever. God, that was your first. First movie that made you cry. I never cried to a movie. He never cries. Never, never, nope. never, never, never cries. I'm still waiting on the day that I see him cry. You think you'll cry when I walk down the aisle once no. we get married? Probably not. I don't cry to anything. The uh, the oh. last time I can remember myself almost crying was when I was having back spasms and she had to help me out because oh, that was gosh. some serious pain. But I mean, besides that, it's just when I was real young and me and Dan were fighting and stuff like that, but since um, then, no, I don't really cry. The first movie that made me cry, I don't straps, really know. Baby straps, baby straps. But a movie that always makes me cry is Southpaw. <laughs> With Jake <laughs> Gyllenhaal and Rachel McAdams. But that's like the one movie that always makes me cry. This, A Star is Born with Lady Gaga and Bradley Cooper. That made me cry. I haven't watched it. Such a good movie. I highly recommend it. It's gonna make you cry though. Probably not him, but it's gonna make you cry. First time losing our virginity. <laughs> How old was I? How old were you? It was a 17? Fem. Pretty special. Oh, sugar. Actually, I have to think about this. I think I was like 50. No, you were younger than that. Was I? It wasn't with me. Ooh. Ooh. I think you were 13. I thought you told me you were 13. 13. 14. That's young to start having sex. <laughs> That's, uh, I can't imagine like having... like 8th grade or something. I can't imagine having sex when I was 13. Um... How old was I? It was when I got the, I, it was when I, it's when I got my bunny. Thank you. It was 2014. Yeah, got that area. 2014, so I it was in like November, September. So I was 17. No, 16. Oh. Stay safe, kids. Where are the condoms? All right, first breakup. Now we're talking not third grade dating. Mm -hmm. We're talking like a serious high school one. I know you had some serious, I mean not serious, serious. 
I mean, probably like the serious one probably would have been like. And then. The first like serious like high school. And then. Mine was probably. But we like were on and off, and it was like not. I don't know. My mom said in kindergarten, I tried dating the whole class, apparently. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Where are we at? 22 minutes. If you're still watching by now. Thank you. Am I so, allowed to show this in a video? Because I feel like this is like, I shouldn't yeah, be like show it. It's advertising. We are advertising Chick-fil-A. I don't think you can Not do that, sponsored. Oh. Yeah, we can. can you, oh, so if it's like... We're not sponsored. It's like me saying I can't have my Michael Kors purse in the back. Oh. You can, you can have, or my Apple Watch. Like I just had the best chicken deluxe sandwich I've ever had in my life. It's all good. I have a Chick Fil A right down the road for me. So good. That's probably for another video, or this thing's gonna go to like thirty. We minutes. can do like a mukbang next time. What the hell is a mukbang or mukbang, mukbang, whatever you want to call it. Um, is when you get food and you bring it back home. Ew, oh, and you eat it? Yeah, and you just no. talk. Who wants to sit here and watch someone eat Actually, stuff? a lot of people, it's actually really popular. That's real gross. I understand, like, when it's, like, the soap cutting, it's, like... The ASMR. But, like, to sit here and be like, hey, I you know. That's gross. Yeah, I you don't should know. Watch people like it, though. I don't know why, but people like it. But anyways, that is it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know what you guys want to see with the handsome devil since he's now in Pennsylvania. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see in your next in my next video. And yay! Peace out, dog. Peace out.